वेलकम अगेन टू माई चैनल ऑर्गेनिक एंड हाइड्रोपोनिक अर्बन ग्रो ग्रो फ्रेंड्स वी हैव जस्ट एंटर इन टू द नवम्बर मंथ एंड टूडे इट इज टर्न टू सी वॉट ऑल ग्रोइंग इन टू दिस अर्बन नेट हाउस एंड सी दॉट इज द कंडीशन ऑफ द क्रॉप इन टू इट सो लेट एस गो इन साइड एंड वॉच एंड अंडरस्टैंड वॉट ऑल आर ग्रोइंग एंड वॉट इज द कंडीशन सो लेट एस नाउ एंटर इन टू द अर्बन नेट हाउस सो फ्रेंड्स वी हैव जस्ट एंटर इन टू द नेट हाउस एंड यू कैन सी दैट इमीजिएटली lot of vegetation is there and all the things is growing very vigorously now we we'll start from the right on this right it's a bush beans we have supported it beans with the two wires and now you can see the beans are fruiting fully we have started already the harvesting so some of the beans are ready again for the harvest new flowering is there new pod are setting so everything is happening into this uh, bush beans now on the left is the ginger Last video I have told you that ginger is growing well, and now it has reached almost to the height of four feet. So this year, when ginger is growing very well, and you can see the lot of shoots is growing into it. That means we are going to get good harvest of the ginger this year. So this is a very healthy growth of the ginger over here. As we move to the next bed, this is the tomato and beetroot mix cropping. I have put a video just couple of days back on the sowing. and you can see that now the plants are set and started growing in the beet you can see it's a good germination we have got and somewhere it is 3 to 4 plants per seed it is happening many times the one seed having a 4 to 5 plants now what we'll do we'll thin out this plant and shift this plant wherever it is less or we can shift that plant somewhere else also so now in the bush bean also we have put some of the tomato plants and if you see this this tomato plant is also now set you can see over here so these are also set into this this are as a part of relay cropping now the work left is to uh trellis the tomato into vertical so that it will give the good harvest in the next bed it that was the french bean the french bean was doing average but still it is giving some fruits so we'll take out this fruit in french bean again we have put the relay and in the relay crop we have done the zucchini so here you can see we have put the zucchini seeds and it is going to come out in a day or two we have put two days back so it will come out as a relay crop after some time we are going to remove this french bean and replace it with some other uh, low height crop now next on the line is this low height grow bags in this grow bags we have grown the cucumber and you can see that this cucumber is still giving fruit little bit of yellowing is over there but still it is giving lot many fruits and lot many new fruits are also setting you can see the lot of new fruits over there and this is giving regular harvest to us so here is the new shoot again giving us the fruits so we are going to continue this for meanwhile and at the same time you can see some digging is there into the bags we have put recently the spinach into it so we have put six bags of spinach and another six bags we are going to put with the coriander next we are going to come into this bed here is a turmeric you can see the vigorous growth of turmeric in between some issue is with the water and some leaves are dried out we have correct that issue and now you can see again the new growth is there the turmeric also having a new shoots many of the new shoots and it is doing well so we are going to remove this all this dry leaves and again our turmeric will be growing the new shoot and the good crop next in the line is the purple yam the purple yam vines are very vigorously grown and more the vine vigorous is there more of the size of the tuber is we are going to get so this vine is again going to grow for some time till the cold start once the temperature will be down the vine will start storing food into the roots and will get the good harvest of the purple yam in the last line we have done this uh, pole beans now here you can see the pole bean is started fruiting and we are getting this type of pods over here as a fruit next in the line is the another type of pole bean and this is also started fruiting and you can see the fruits over here a lot of new buds is there 
so we are going to get a good harvest from this in the last line these are yard long bean this yard long bean we are growing for the seeds and you can see the very long yard long bean and this is now dried and we are soon going to harvest for the seed for the next season so this area has become little dense so we cannot do any new planting into this area but soon once the the purple yam vine will be drying up then we'll start new planting into this area here is the chili still producing some chili but due to the shadowing condition it is st starting producing less amount of the chili so this is all about all the what we are growing as a now into this grow back garden in urban garden this garden is around 600 square feet and in this 600 square feet we are growing many type of vegetables and most of the vegetables are doing good this is fitted with the drip to make the automatic watering so friends how do you like my urban grow house and what all i am growing please write me back into the comment box and if you like this please give me the thumb and share it with your friends you can also start one of the urban grow house with the net and grow bags like this and produce lot of fresh vegetables for your consumption happy growing